Oh, what is going off? Oh, no, the Saurus. It's in my generator. God damn it. Hello, guys. I am back in the world of Ark Survival Ascended on the center with the boys. And yes, I am in my leveling up pit. Oh, my God. It's chaos in here. Uh, right, everybody's getting all maxed out. Everybody's getting juiced up. Uh, I had a comment yesterday about uh, this Rex not being on aggressive. And they said, oh, yeah, Jim, uh, when you did the copy settings to all, that Rex was uh, involved in it as well. No, it wasn't. It wasn't. Let me show you. Right. So all these Rexes on here, these all are breeding. They're on ignore whistle groups and breeding and passive. So everything that kicks off here, those guys up there are not going to move. That's that's the way it's intended. Uh, and then let me, excuse me, coming through. Let's just get through the carnage. And uh, huh. right, close it in. Not when you might like, escaping into the world. So all my dinos in there are on aggressive. So they should be munching on everything that gets in their path, basically. Right, excuse me. There we go. Right, so this is the control dino. And if I just go behavior look, uh, behavior. So ignore whistle groups and disable mating. And then I, I can basically copy that to all nearby Rexes. So that is what's happening. So these guys are breeding and passive and ignoring whistles. So if I whistle like a J whistle, they will just ignore me. That's what I want. That's what you want. Uh, but... This Rex in here, excuse me, coming through. Right, well, go on, Sausage, you take care of stuff. That's it. Get big and strong. Uh, <laughs> I've even got my monkey in here as well. Uh-huh. But this Rex, this Rex here, uh, we have a look at his behavior. Behavior. He has not got ignore whistle. He has not got enable wandering. He has not got mating. And his stance is aggressive. So... By the by, that should be munching stuff down. He should be in with the kill with these boys. But he's not. He's just chilling. He's just ignoring everything. So there we go. I, I hope I've cleared that up for you. Uh, so I use a leveling up pit. Uh, I would have used one earlier, to be fair. But uh, I was having far too much fun just taking it at a slow pace. But now these levels need to come in thick and fast. Uh, and I'm nearly, I'm nearly level 100 as well. So there we go. Let's uh, let's get that up there. Oh my guys are on outside as well, though. <laughs> my guys are like, I think they're on neutral outside. There you go. So this is the only way I can level up this Rex is basically by just getting involved, because the auto way of just putting dinos to aggressive doesn't work on these Rexes anyway. I don't I don't know about uh, vanilla Rexes, but this is the the modded Tyrannosaurus. Right, come out, sausage. Oh, God. Uh, that's the only other thing about having uh, multiple dinos here. You're leveling up at the same time. It gets a bit crowded. I mean, I could have made the arena a little bit bigger. But never mind. How far are we away? Well, I'll tell you what. Let's... Uh... Oh, God, spider, please. The spider's kicking off. Uh, let's put you on... Wait, let... I mean, let's whistle passive. Whistle passive. There you go. Right. Right, you're on Wanda. And you come down here, Sausage. Uh, you're right, you've got one level. <laughs> and a crap ton of prime meat. Holy crap. So, yeah, so it's also a meat farm. Uh, well, mainly a prime meat farm as well. You can have uh, melee. I mean, this guy is pretty much leveled up anyway. We've got, like, another level. It's harder to squeeze those last few levels out. Uh, and you've got us. You've exactly the same as well. Look, you can have melee damage. There you go. Yeah, it's harder to squeeze those last few levels out, but uh, if you just leave these guys on aggressive in here for a hot minute, they mm, they will. Oh, excuse me, quick through. Oh, get leveled up fairly quick. Right. Apart from this guy, so we have to go through and do that. Oh, okay. There we go. So that's me at level 100 now. Is it? Yes, it is. <laughs> right, so I'm pretty much tibbity top now. I've unlocked everything, lovely. Right, let me go turn these eggs off, cuss. 
Like they're just going to keep pop popping out forever. So, I mean, you can do this as a vanilla one. You can use different kind of dinos. You can use gigas. I mean, if you've got gigas and you're breeding gigas up, uh, you'll just have to make it a little bit taller, but same principle. And obviously it depends on the mating and egg laying rate and stuff like that. But if you build a big enough one and you can have a decent pit, right, behavior disable mating and behavior copy to all now everybody's turned off boom so that's it copy to 12 t-rexes so everybody's on chill now including my non-aggressive one there we go so there's no more eggs coming out apart from oh god no i didn't want to claim you god damn it all right these sausages here oh dear me all right, go on then, get rid of everybody. There you go. Oh yeah, hold the munch. Right. There you go, you've got another level. That's that sand. Lovely. I love that sand. Well, I tell you what. Let's put this guy on aggressive. Um, Avia aggressive, you can mop up. I will get my thylet aggressive. There you go, sausage. Off you pop. And he's away. <laughs> nice. Right, so the meat and potatoes of it is if we look at our we are Oh yeah, apart from the tech stuff. Uh 99. Oh wait, no, we're not we're level 99. There we go. So we've got um Oh no, we've got to put the level on first. Donut. I will have mm, fortitude. Just a little bit of a splash of fortitude. Now we're level 100. Yeah, baby. Uh huh. Now we've unlocked everything. So we've got the, the turrets. Um, stuff I'm not really bothered about. Uh, Leviathan. We haven't even looked at that yet. Uh, we haven't looked at any of the Leviathan stuff. But it seems to be quite, uh, quite a lot. We'll probably go check that out at some point. And riot gear, yes. But this is what we want. Where are we? Oh yeah. Where is it? That's the that's the ticket. That's the baby. Right. Now we can complete our battleship. That's what we're gonna do today. Uh I've still got a little bit of farming to do. Uh, uh right. Can I can I leave you in here, boys and girls? Right, let's put you on aggressive as well. And uh, you can mop up as well. Uh-huh. Aggressive. There you go. That's it. Go on, sausage. Fill your boots. Excuse me, coming through. Right. Get rid of that. Uh, let's pick my guys up. Um, You've got some building stuff on you, anti sausage? A little bit. Holy crap. Ooh. Might need to put that somewhere. Pick you up. And there is a donut around here, isn't there? Somewhere. Or has he just gone wandering away? Right. So I'm going to get some stuff. Um, I need still quite a lot. So I want to put my rocket turret. Probably swap it over because I've got a minigun up there. And a rocket turret down here. So I think the rocket turret would be better on top. Because you've got like more of a like a vantage point there. You can swing around more. So I'm going to put the minigunner on here. That's the manned minigunner. So we have to get on the, the, the thing. Right. Mount the gun. So yeah. So that is that. But I think that would be pre uh, pretty much suited to a rocket launcher. Oh yeah. <laughs> uh, and then put the minigun down at the bottom. Right, okay. And I'm going to need some more bullets and rockets and stuff as well. So if I put that down here and then the rocket launcher up there. Sweet! Uh, I put this on because I was sick of keep going around, swimming, getting on and then running around when I needed to craft something that I couldn't craft on there. Right. Let's go and have a look. See how far or how close we are to... The thing let's put them in there a hot second oh god there's all sorts of stuff in there pillars i've got stuff in here god damn it right 
There we go. Right, chuck them out. Boom, boom. And... Uh, uh, no, not Rocky. It's a rocket. There. Can we pull for one of them? Oh, yeah. So need some more electronics. But I think if I go to my uh, base area, I've got a load already crafted up. Right, let's go. I'll leave everybody on there for a hot minute. And go back to base. Right, the railway line, I'm probably going to split that over and then come here onto the beach bit. And then go back and rejoin the main track. Depending on how how complicated of a job it's going to be and how much resources it's going to take as well. Um, I get quite a lot of metal from up there. It's not a problem. Um, but it's just, it's just the time to do it. An aberration is fastly approaching. Uh, I've got some other little bits and bobs I want to do. Um, I don't think I'm going to do any bosses on here because it's like the arena bosses. I'm just having fun doing my own little thing. Um, so I'm probably going to spend the time finishing off building the railway and doing some other little bits. Maybe, maybe troll Axeman a bit more. I, I don't know. Mm. I mean, Axeman's set on doing all the bosses and getting all the trophies and stuff. Whereas I'm more set on, well, getting Axeman. <laughs> Right, let's get a little bit closer. Closer, closer, so the pull works. Um, stop! Right. Let's go up to the crafting deck. Uh-huh, boom. And... Rocket. Right, pull for one of them. Oh, we need 26 more metal ingots. God damn it. Uh, I can't think. Yeah, I made some more. Oh, I would have had enough if I didn't make them stupid walls over there. Um, so I did have a load of metal walls on me. Um, but I didn't have enough, so I had to craft some more. So I came back this way to get some metal. Right. So now I've got to go up to the forge. I think there was some more brewing up there. We'll have a quick look. I've not even cut yet, but, uh, well, enjoy. Enjoy the base and the, the, the frolicking that we're doing. Hey, wait. Where's that? Uh... Oh, yeah, he's there, look. I say, where's my dude? <laughs> I've got dinos that, like, just wild dinos are just chilling out. He's just hanging here. And also, excuse me, coming through. Mr. Angry Nudgy. There you go. Yep. Yeah. It's all right. You're stuck in there, aren't you, stupid? Right, I've left him there as well. So if I go up here, I should have plenty of metal because I think I put a load in before I came down. Right, let's have a look. Let's just see if I can pull uh, ingots. And I'm going to need some more ingots anyway to make rockets. Oh, I've got 2,000 in there, Paul. Boom. Sweet. Uh, now we have to go down the chain again. Right. So I think I'm going to pull them all the way down. You've seen me do this before. It it's a bit of a process. So I, I think I'm going to say see you in a bit. Okay, so that's all the metal pulled down from all the way up there down to the storage place over there. And starving. Lovely. Oh, wait. No. Let's go in here. Uh-huh. All right. Okay. Oh, let's get that. Let's get some food. Might as well. Holy crap, lots of food. Yummy. Right, rockets. <clears throat> I do have some gunpowder, but I'm going to need a ton more. Uh, I'm probably going to need some more metal as well. Right, let's do... Pull for one of them. Oh! God, polymer. <laughs> God damn. Um, right, composites. I do have some penguins. So, uh, cementing paste and obsidian. We're close enough to there. So, if I could do... Uh, I don't know. Say 500. Let's do that then. Boom. So... Alright, that's everything in there for 500. Polymer. That's the thing. 
Um, right. Hopefully, hopefully, we should have enough. Um, we might need to go on the Anki and get some more flint. Uh, let's go to the chemistry bench and just see if we can do some gunpowder. Right. Uh, a thousand, can we? We should have plenty of charcoal because I've just pulled that as well. Right. Let's go. So we can do 660 something, 70 something of that. I've got plenty of spark powder. I don't think I can. Uh, could I cue that? 94. Yep. So whatever I've got, I've got. But if I need any more, I'm going to need my Anki. Right. I'll let that percolate a hot minute because it's going to be a little while. Um, I am going to probably swap guns as well. Right. There. We'll take these out of there. And pick this up. We've got to repaint this as well. Pick up mini turret. Boom. Right. This is going to live down here. And... Oh, that fits lovely. Look at that look. Oh, no, wait, wait, wait. We've got to have a get perfect. Right, can I zoom out? See what that looks like with the little... Oh. That's the ticket there. Oh, I don't know. Should we go forward a little bit? I think there's enough room to get around, isn't there? I think it's perfect there. <gasps> no, you moved, Jim. You moved. Right, get that line on. Right, there we go. Let's get it. Let's get it level with that line. Yeah. Ta-da! Lovely. Uh, right, let's just get on. Oh, we're gonna we're gonna shoot through flags and everything. Never mind. Right. Put some bullets in. Well, unfortunately, there's nothing that we can. Oh, hey, shoot at. Nothing within range anyway, because everything's kind of been scared away. <laughs> uh. Anyway, we'll try it out when we go for a test voyage. I think that's it. That's pretty cool. And also these are targeting um, targeted survivors or tamed creatures. That's right, Axe. <laughs> Best not get too close. So we've got plenty of bullets in there. And I think one's taming wild. Yeah, wild creatures only, which that one is just soaked all the bullets up. Random things flapping about and stuff. And I've got one on the back here as well. That's doing wild. Oh, and that's just got two. Oh, no. So survivors and tamed creatures. And that's got two bullets in. Oh, did somebody try and sneak onto the boat? Did they? Did they? Just saying. Right. Okay. Let's shoot you boys in. Boom. Uh, with all this waffling, I bet I've... Uh, I bet it's already crafted up. Let me go check. Oh, no. Still, still a ways yet. Right. See you in a bit. Okay, so that's that little job done, and we are back here again. So, rocket. Uh, pull for a thousand, yeah. <laughs> thousand. No, Jim, no. Just one, please. Ta da. Alright, that's that. And could we do. Oh, hear me. Could we do a hundred? Uh, how expensive are they? <gasps> Quite expensive. Uh, we could only do seven anyway. We've got seven. All right, okay. Oh, 31. Okay. We've got some more polymer somewhere then. Well, I'll take that. Right. Let's go plonk this in its place. Make sure that we get it all level and equal. And... Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh. Take that snapping off. Boom. There we go. Is that... Oh no, you see, that's a bit that way. And a little bit further back. Oh! Just a flick of the mouse and it's all... <gasps> that's perfect. That's lovely. Oh! Boom. Oh, what a thing of beauty. And let's give it a, a splash of gym. Uh-huh, right. Let's have a look at the region. Yeah, we'll have a yellow seat. Apply. Bucket seats. Definitely. Come on, then. There you go. 
the accents. Let's just mm, uh, maybe. All right, switch over. Ooh yeah. And what's that? Mm, yeah, maybe that. We'll leave the rest. Leave the silver bit showing. Nice. <laughs> so that's it. We got the armaments up, up and ready. Right, let's get some ammunition. Thirty-one. Probably need more than that anyway, but never mind. We'll get the. What do we need? Polymer. So we probably need to go over to the cliff uh, and get. Oh, I did a little jiggle when you put it in. Oh, I'm gonna fire at something. We're gonna fire at something. All right, let's go shoot something. <laughs> Right, let's go out and give it a test firing. Nice. All right then, let's give it a test of firing the guns. <laughs> All right, we'll get off. And let's go up here. Mm -hmm, excuse me, going through. Ooh, yeah. So I've turned all the auto turrets off. Because if you get close. Oh, hey. Oh, what is going off? Oh, no, the Saurus. Just eat my generator. God damn it. Oh, he's at my generator. <laughs> you absolute sausage. Right. Test. New target. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. Well, it takes me a hot minute to get to the... Oh, this is where you need a crew. Uh, oh, yeah. Yes. Boom! Alright, that's that one gone. Oh, my generator's gone though! So it's not safe. They can chew through walls. Got it. Right, we're in total blackness, so we can't craft anything on the... Uh, on the, uh, the boat yet. Alright, let's go over here. Let's get lined up. Let's shorten this queue down. Uh, excuse me, coming through. Okay. And back up. Yeah, we need a crew on here. Holy crap. What time you've run around and got everything. And... Yeah, that's it. Goodbye. Thank you for your service. Did we get everybody? Oh, it's not accurate. There's still people standing. Oh, it's... Oh, lucky. <laughs> okay then, Jim, with the blood lost. Ooh, rocket launcher. Now that's my side. Will, will that do that? Goodbye. Yes. <laughs> uh, penguins. Goodbye. Boom. Wait, did you not kill me? Did more damage with minigun. Well, hello. Just a few. Into the crowd. How accurate is that? Oh, there's penguins everywhere. <laughs> Scattered them to the winds. Wait, can we do multiple? Oh, rocket barrage. Rocket barrage. All right then, Jim. Whoa, slow down. There's just one penguin left. Okay, right. Let's let's have a fire of the cannons because these are a little bit awkward. Right. Let's go down deck. Whoa, excuse me, coming through. So the cannons. Um, right. So we're supposed to be aim down, aim left. It does the click, but it doesn't move. So I, I don't know. Let's just fire. Oh, oh, where's that going? That went way over the island. What about the other side? Let's open the door. And... Fire. Um, again, other side of the island. <laughs> yeah, so you've got to be pretty much bob on with them. Uh, it doesn't give you any indication when you turn or lift or lower. It, they're, just, they're just there. Uh, I think it's because they're built in, like, an enclosure. Um, so you don't get the, the aim that we do on this bad boy. 
Close enough, though. Right, let's try not to destroy the shop. Ooh. Lead a bit there, because it, it goes down a bit. Or maybe just bruise it. Oh, yep, yep, there we go. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, dear me. Right, we, uh, well, I need to craft another generator. Let's see if I've got enough supplies on board to do such a thing. Yeah, no thesaurus. All right, let's go. Uh, oh, wait. Um, gas, gasoline, gasolina. No, no, no. There we go. Oh, the only seven left anyway. Right, okay. So we've got that. Did it damage anything? No. It literally snuck in, chomped the generator, and didn't damage anything else. That's kind of sneaky. Well, I'm not happy with that. Uh, oh, no, no, no. We need to go upstairs. Let's redo that. So, yeah, so it's like a mobile meat snack now. Great. Um, uh... Gen, I don't think, I don't think we, I've got any electrical stuff. I think I pulled everything. Yep, electronics. I can't do that here. Right, so there we go. Right then, guys, I think that's going to be it for this one. We are ready. I need to make a crap ton of rockets and guns and stuff. Uh, then tomorrow, what we're going to do is we're going to go over to Axis Place and we are going to obliterate it. Yes, everybody wanted me to do it. It's happening. Uh, I'm going to obliterate the tower and get rid of all the aggressive dinos. And I am going to put Axeman's like effigy in the pile of it with some kind of sarky note. <laughs> right there, guys. Don't forget to whack a like on it, uh, comment, and subscribe if you're not subscribed. That would be kind of nice. And uh, all that's left me to do is to wave. And see you in the next one.